Hello everyone, before I start the video, I'll mention that some other people like Nintendo Land and Switch Stop talked about the remix. So after this video, I suggest you should watch their videos. They'll be linked in the description. Otherwise, enjoy the video. Hello guys, welcome to this video on what needs to be changed in the next Super Mario 64 remake. This video has things I would fix, new things, etc. Number one, the controls aren't bad in the Nintendo 64 version of Mario 64, but in the DS remake, the controls aren't that good. X is first person view, B is to jump, A is to attack slash use Yoshi's tongue, Y is to dash. In the original, you would just gain speed by using the control stick. Maybe that's because the Nintendo 64 controller only had A and B, but holding Y? That's weird. The left trigger button is to zoom in slash out, and the right trigger is to kneel down. Maybe B and A can be jumping, and Y and X can be attacking slash Yoshi's using his tongue. L doesn't do anything, as well as ZL. R can be Lakitu slash Mario cam, the C up can be for first person, the C down can be zooming out, and the C right and left can be moving right and left. And the right stick is for movement. I think it's better using, and you can change them like how most Super Mario games do, to B is to attack and A is jump, vice versa. The music in Mario 64 is awesome and catchy, but it's overused a lot. I get the Bowser level music though. I think there should be at least a slightly different theme in each level. Wands Fortress should be slightly different from Bob on Battlefield and Tiny Huge Island. And it shouldn't be hard to change Cool Cool Mountain and Jolly Roger Bay music from each other, because there's only two snow levels. And J JRB can be a remix. Dar Dar Docks can be remixed differently as well. And the secret aquarium music can be the original one. TikTok Clock and Rainbow Ride can be two remixes. The side music can stay the same. Like in, in, in the stages that have them. A new character would be, you guessed it, Waluigi. Waluigi could have a normal attack like Mario, Luigi, and Wario. He could probably run faster, and the power, power flower ability could give him a tennis racket. He could whack walls that could be broken, like the wall on Womp's Fortress wall. He, he can be unlocked by defeating a boss. The boss you could defeat is a charging chuck that could be in a tennis outfit with a tennis racket. People say the camera is bad in the game. I can agree with that. I, I don't like it. The remake could have a, an analog camera. That would be better. This might sound crazy, but it would be cool to have more than 150 stars. Maybe it could be only 150, but it would be cool if there were a few more secret stars. Maybe 180 stars in the game would be good. Multiplayer. The one I didn't script in the script, you could probably play together with some Joy-Cons or a few Pro Controllers. Maybe there could be only like, let's see, one to four players, like how 3D World did. Uh, maybe one to four, probably. But this would be a fun concept. The original one didn't have any multiplayer. The DS one has multiplayer, but it's not the story mode version. So it would be fun to play with other people, and there could probably be an online multiplayer. Now this is the last thing, some new courses. There could be some secret star courses, or a new unique one. 
Yeah, it would be cool. I like the stages in this game, so I would like to see some more. Well, that's a bit about it. Tell me some of your guys' ideas in the comments. See you in the next video. Make sure to like and subscribe if you want to see some more content like this. If you want me to make, I don't know, some Mario 64 videos. So yeah, bye!